When you're ready to share your jam with your students or whoever you're sharing it with, come on up to the blue share button. And when I hover it, you can see right now it says it's private only to me. That's how it is by default. So to share it, you need to click here. And then these settings will open up, which is quite familiar if you've shared any other Google file. It works much the same way. So I'm gonna come down here to this get link section. And right now it says it's restricted. Only people added can open the link. So if I wanted to share it only with very specific people, I could add them by typing in their name or email right here. But chances are I want to just be able to post my link in my Google Classroom or wherever. So I wanna change the link. And right now it's set to only work in my Google domain. So chances are it says your, the name of your school board right here. And that uh, it's set to just view. So if you do just wanna share it within your school board, you could leave it like that and then come over here and set it to either viewer or editor based on what you'd like to do. Probably editor if you're uh, using this as a collaborative space. Or when you click here, uh, you can go back to restricted like it was before, or you can also change it to anyone with the link. So this opens it up publicly on the internet, which is nice because if your students aren't signed in quite right, it'll still work or parents could see it. So depending on your audience, that may be necessary. And again, over here, you can switch from viewer to editor. And now whatever your settings are, it'll be good to go with just copying this link right here and then pasting that wherever you need it.